well music has changed in all formats of delivery of music is different you know before used to be you know publishers just literally published sheet music and you reduced your song to a mechanical form and so that would be your two streams of income print and sheet music and mechanicals from sales now with the certainly advent of digital and certainly uh, imprint labels and smaller record companies and reissue record companies and remix record company it gets very very complicated to track it so that's why people generally enlist th the services of Harry Fox if you have those multiple kinds of reissues re-releases remixes then you're in a digital environment and Harry Fox quite frankly is you know entering this new frontier along with the rest of us and these licenses are brand new and the the users don't really n know yet what the format is on how to pay the collecting agencies don't really know how to format the law has not really kept up in pace with what these new forms are using it's it's unclear without getting too technical but it's interesting that when music is used in an iTunes format it's it's unclear whether that use in iTunes is looked at as the sale of a record. If it's looked at as a sale of a record, the artist would get their artist royalty rate, typically 12 or 14 percent of an artist royalty rate. That's if iTunes is looked as if you're selling a record. If iTunes usage is looked as that it's a third-party license, and we're just licensing our song to iTunes and not really selling a physical record, it looks as a license, and the license, the royalty rate for a third-party license is typically 50-50. So the artist would get 50% of that 66 cents, or would they get 14% of the six? Unresolved. And it's sort of problematic, as you can well imagine. The artists think that it's a third-party license, and they want 50% of that iTunes money. The label perceives it as selling just another record and they only want to pay the artist 12%. And there's a bit of a divide. And not resolved, it's, re it's really the state of affairs of what's going on.